The battle against President Trump and House Democrats continues to escalate. The Trump administration is using executive privilege to prevent Congress from getting a hold of crucial documents on a decision to add a citizenship question to the 2020 census. This comes as the House Oversight Committee gears up for a major vote about whether to hold Attorney General William Barr and Commerce Secretary Wilbur Ross in contempt for failing to cooperate with subpoenas. Documents acquired by the New York Times revealed the question was designed to benefit Republicans by alienating, alienating non-white communities. Representative Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez slammed the Trump administration by and for bypassing the normal process for changing the census. It is one of the most vital and sensitive things that we do in our government. Any change to the census, any addition of a question, usually takes five years of a process to make sure that it is vetted, that every word has been tested, to make sure that it is effective, because it is one of the most important things that we do. So it's not that I want to, this is not about whether or not I want to know who is a citizen in the United States or not. What I want to know is why after, why this question was added, why two years have been shaved off of that five year process. I want to know why we have skipped every normal mandated procedure in testing how this question gets added in the census. I want to know the House Oversight Committee will hold their contempt vote at about 4 p.m. Eastern. Chairman Elijah Cummings says he wants to give lawmakers time to read the executive privilege letter from the Department of Justice.